Post. Um, Carl, let's talk a little bit about you know the, this administration with the um, Military Religious Freedom Foundation. Um, you know the new guru of uh, the Pentagon's new religious tolerance guru is basically saying sharing the gospel is like rape. And uh, are you, how up are you on this story, and how big of a deal is this? Well, it is a excuse me. It is a big deal, and I'm I'm up pretty pretty good on the story. Uh, I don't know if you know the very latest is the military has backed off of that yeah. statement, and and they have watered it down. Are you familiar with that? Yes. Yeah, yes. We're, gonna, we're sure. Yeah. Now. Okay. I, I thought you were, but yes, uh, they have backed off and and began to back up and kind of uh, shuffle their feet and apologize a little bit and say, well, of course, any faith is welcome to share their faith, et cetera, et cetera. But what's shocking to me, Amy, as you just so. Uh, wonderfully expressed is that what would cause them to say that in the first place well it's just a part it to me it's it's just indicative of this entire paradigm shift that's happened under this administration and and I don't want to make them out to be the only evil that America has ever experienced because prior administrations have brought in all manner of evil as well but it's a part of this fundamentally changing America that Obama promised and he's doing it it's a part of this hope and change that he said and he's doing it for the first time in mm -hmm. unprecedented in U.S. history, the U.S. military, the number one superpower of the world, is openly celebrating homosexuality. And I have a sneaking suspicion that that's what that statement was rooted in. Because, again, Christianity is very distinctive. The Word of God is very distinctive in its statements about right and wrong, uh, truth and lies, and uh, particularly uh, human sexuality. So I, I have a, 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 a suspicion, and it's just my opinion, that that initial statement may have been rooted in, in that whole uh, radical homosexual movement that now seems to have uh, swept the American military. And by the way, has made us a laughing stock among other superpowers. We're the only uh, superpower military military in the world that that openly celebrates homosexuality among its ranks. Oh, you know, Carl, I, I, I try to get my hands around uh, this administration and what's going on. Uh, on the one hand, it's...